Everybody online, looking good. A companion podcast to the collaborative blog and gaming community that's playing as life allows. This is multiplaying. Well, let's start the insanity. We have clearance, Clarence. Roger, Roger. What's our vector, Victor? Hello? Uh, Great heavens! What kind of radio show is this? It's happening. Hello, all, and welcome to Multiplaying. I'm Shannon, and I have a vodka martini this evening, and we have with us Steve. How's it going? I have got uh, water from the finest of springs. The faucet? Yes. Oh, yeah. And we have with us Jason. I have Coors Light, which is like water. Yes, it is. I'm the only one drinking the hard stuff tonight. Man. Yeah, and this is a quick one, folks. Um, we're only we had the whole you know Dave's not here thing going on Dave? Like, as expected. Dave? <laughs> whenever Dave's we say, not here. whenever we say on a show that we're going to have somebody on the next show, it never happens. So bound to happen. You know, life happened. So he's not available, and Todd's not available. So we're going to postpone until they're both available, and we can have a proper interview. And also, we really don't have. Um, uh, Todd was going to do the editing for the show. We don't really have time to edit a full show, um, the rest of us, because we've got holiday things scheduled. So, quickie show, just to let you know we're not, you know, pod fading or anything. And You're wondering why that download is so fast. Yeah. <laughs> and we're going to kind of have sporadic, we're not going to have our normal full schedule um, probably until the new year. So, Dave? <laughs> Um, but we did have a few things to cover. So we had a contest that super huge, hard contest for the tour. What was the answer? What was your TF2? Um, what, what names did you decide on for your TF2 team? We went with, uh, I went with Cal Naughton Jr. And, uh, Jason went with Ricky Bobby and got the images all changed and everything. And what, what movie is that from? Gone with the Wind. (laughs) <laughs> Tell day good night. Thank yeah. you, Steve. <laughs> and who won? Who who was the first person to email in with that answer? The first person to uh email in was Dan Salmons. That's the the name I sent you, right? I didn't Yes, yes it is. <laughs> okay. I don't it was know. Dan uh, Salmons. Yeah, I, I sent the quote off to Dan, so hopefully he got it downloaded correctly. I haven't heard back from him. Yeah, Dan, if you have any trouble, let us know. There's a few fixes we can do if there's you know, any problems with that. If it's somehow connected to Jason directly, we can still fix it. So we'll get you a KOTOR for free. <laughs> You're going to play that shit. Yeah, you will play that game and you will like it. Well, well, you'll you'll play it. <laughs> no, he'll like it. It's KOTOR. KOTOR is awesome. awesome. Best game awesome. ever. And um, so congratulations and thanks for participating in our contest. I was shocked we got an answer. People listen. And uh, we... Not only did we get uh, someone actually entered our contest and won, but we also got fan mail this week. Yes, we did. Holy uh, cow. I know. Isn't it cool? <laughs> it is we're cool. Like, we're like we're podcasters. <laughs> we're podcasters. Uh, I'll read that off real quick. Uh, okay. It's Glenn sent this to us, and it just says, Dear guys and gal. I think that's you, Shannon. Uh, I remember I stumbling I across... Huh? I wouldn't make that statement too boldly. <laughs> That's Brian. <laughs> it's, it's usually Paz. Uh, I remember stumbling across your podcast podcast when Warhammer was in full swing, and then you guys suddenly dropped off the map. Uh, of all the Warhammer podcasts, you guys are among my favorite to listen to of all all the time to- at the time. Excuse Aww. me. Aww. I listened to other multi-platform gaming podcasts at work and ventured off to find yours a while back, and have been uh, and have. Been listening to the previous podcast to catch up to the latest one. Where where you guys are informative as well as goofy and give your direct impressions that adds a lot to a podcast that tends more towards the gamer that has to work. Thankfully, I get to listen to podcasts at work. I was also part of the Catalyst group that was helping Tony and Lori when they were doing the Abyss podcast and was featured on podcast 13 of theirs for crafting. Keep up the good work, Glenn. So Neat. and Glenn is still looks like still playing uh, on the Asmodian side on the Mar- Marchutan server on Ion. So very there you go. cool, very yeah. cool. Uh, yeah. yeah, I can explain the dropped off the face of the earth uh, during Cotcast. I had I, I um, was 
not satisfied with our hosting service um, there for a little while, and I was attempting to switch us to Libsyn, who we are, who Multiplaying is now being hosted through, and it, it didn't. It didn't go as smoothly as expected. So what happened was when I made that initial switch, it looked like our feed was broken. Like if you got us through iTunes or anything like that, it looked broken. And there was no way then to go backwards, you know, and fix it. You, people would have fix to... Fix it! Yeah. <laughs> people had to unsubscribe, search for us again, and resubscribe. But there's no way to tell them that. So we, we did lose quite a bit of original... Um, listeners from from that <laughs> horrible experience, and that's why this time when we switched um, to Libsyn, we were much more careful. We kept the other one open, and you know, gave verbal cues <laughs> to go over and resubscribe to our new one. So it, yes, it thanks for well. anybody that did jump over on that switch. Yeah, that's awesome. And you know, I wonder like how many people we we lost that way that actually liked us. That's sad. Tons. Glad he likes us and he Think found of the us revenue again. that we're losing. Oh uh, wait, we don't make any money. Yeah, we don't do that. <laughs> I could be I could be sleeping on a real bed. <laughs> you will sleep on the couch and you will like it. <laughs> well this is supposed to be I cool. want a Murphy bed. Where do you get one of those? How well, do you those, one of those things install? that come out of the wall? Yeah. How do you we get need one? one of those for this room. That would be cool. Is there a Murphy bed like I want a guy? Murphy futon. <laughs> Like a Murphy couch. That would be cool for this room. I want a Murphy everything. Just <laughs> shit just fold Everything out. out of the wall. Murphy dressers, everything. So um, when you fold it out of the wall, it goes, <laughs> Yes, exactly. Oh, not that kind of Murphy. Sorry. That was bad. Hmm. And what are you doing listening to podcasts? Don't you know what's going on this week? This weekend? Lots of shit. Week? Oh my gosh, everything's free. You should be... It's It's a gaming orgy. I can't, TF2? Even, I can't even download enough shit cause it's free. <laughs> TF2 <laughs> is free, so you're doing that, of course. Um, let's see. Mythic is doing this thing where I, th- I think Ultima Online, but I'm sure War and DAOC are free if you're a pa- previous subscriber. Obviously, if you've never subscribed, then you could just do the free trials, so it's free. And then mm-hmm. um, I got a bone to pick with that, though, by the way. Well, you can wait, because okay. Lotro... Is having a free week. Ion is having a double exp weekend, right? Uh, I think so. And then uh, Age of Conan. Age of Conan is having they switched a over to the like up to twenty is free. I think now. Holy crow! Yeah, yeah, yeah it is. It's up to twenty is always free. Um, Forever, if you get it played by the end of the year. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. And um, yeah, and War obviously it has the endless trial to for tier one. So there is just tons of things to try and do and um yeah, my okay there's my complaint with war is i wanted to, they're doing a 10 day comeback for subscribers and i just wanted to see how it ran on the new computer and t- in order to patch you have to start it start your trial right away why won't they let you get it all patched up and you know because what if you have to leave it running overnight and you waste one of your days that way yeah that's bullshit hmm. yeah. well it is free I know, but other some certain other MMOs let you patch up before you even have to put in your account details. Yeah. Oh, it's a pain in the ass. Yeah. Need to be fixed. Need to fix it. Fix when I wake it. up, it better be fixed. Hmm. I don't think it's gonna. No, no. Just, just between us. I think we're done here. We're we done here? <laughs> yeah, I think so. Yeah, I'm going to play I some have TF2. Well, I've yeah. got Hell yeah. gaming to do, so. What are you going to do? Playing WoW. Aww. You need to get more eggs. Shut up, you. You and you're your... still doing eggs. Ah, you're gonna get eggs. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, you Sorry. boneheads. <laughs> bah, humbug. Well, gentlemen, no point in hanging around this dump any longer. Wait, where are you going? I was gonna make a spread. Show's over, folks. You can't go. All the plants are gonna die. Take off, eh? Thanks for listening to Multiplying, the companion podcast at Multiplying.net. Questions, comments, feedback, errors, etc. can be sent to multiplaying at gmail.com. We invite you to write a review on iTunes and visit our website at www.multiplying.net. We've made a lot of friends, shared a lot of laughs, often at the expense of others. I think some people are going to be upset. Let me just close this conversation by saying you are one unique individual. Thank you and good night.
Dead Workers Party Network, traveling at 88 miles per hour.